I just thought I'd share what I do with the recycled plastic of media that I can't sell. Now, I've mentioned this in live videos, but so I'll take the cases like here. I'll uh, rip this cover off here, which goes in the uh, soft plastic recycling. I can't do anything with that. And normally that contains contaminants anyway. Uh, then they go through my industrial granulator. And then this is what it produces. Lovely shredded polypropylene plastic. Nice bit of microplastic there. You know, our bodies are full of it. So, uh, yeah, this can be used by injection molding machines to make on small or big scale new products. It's one obviously 100% recyclable. Um, or it can be used for resin artists as well, for an infill material, so they uh, use less resin. Obviously, it isn't recyclable at that point. But, yeah, just bag them up into bags of 17 kilos. And then people buy them. And I also like to use uh, zip ties because these can be undone and reused. These bags are recycled plastic, made of recycled plastic as well. So there you go. And um, I get free boxes from a local supermarket. So you can't get better than that, really. And I do this because I produce far more than I'll ever use in my sheet press or my injection molding machine. So I'd rather someone else use it. So if you're after recycled plastic, Drop me a message on Instagram and I'll sort you out a price. And the only thing I would say is I do sell it by like the 17 kilo bag. So I can't ship you like 500 kilos or something like that. I'm small scale. It's just what I can't use. And I also separate colours out. So if there's a particular colour you're after, let me know. I've got quite a long lead time, but black and clear, I've got loads of, well, I say loads, I've got about 50 kilos of each on hand at most most of the time. So yeah, uh, I'm filling that gap for small scale producers.